Hi, my name's Steve Mango. I'm an actor, a business owner, and I was a four-year parishioner of the Church of Scientology Celebrity Center in Hollywood. So you're a new actor and you come to Hollywood. And most actors, when they're first getting started, they'll do background work on TV and film. And the way that you do that is by going to central casting. And they're like the main casting office that um, casts extras on a TV and film. Now there's like two days that you can go a week that Central opens up for actors to line up outside and to register for background work and get into their files. So Scientology knows most actors coming off of the Greyhound bus or just flying into town are going to land at Central Casting. So they have a couple of their um, Division 6 people, which Division 6 is like the new people department of Scientology. And um, they come and they start talking to the different people in line and they'll try to get them to go to one of those workshops like I did, one of those breaking into the industry, how to get started, how to get an agent, how to get into the Screen Actors Guild. So the different weeks, they have a different topic. They'll talk to these um, wannabe actors and they'll tell them, you know, um, you don't want to you know, be an extra. I mean, it's fine if you want to make a couple bucks and try it out once or twice, but I know the real reason why you're here is to try to be an actor and we can show you how to do that. You don't have to just be in the background, you can be the star. And we can give you the tools so you can become that star. We have a workshop tomorrow night at 7.30, can we sign you up and we'll expect you there? So that's kind of the way that they um, try to recruit um, new people totally fresh, because that's their prime candidate, the wannabe actor, the wannabe model, the wannabe musician. They want, they want to catch them, and um, at their most vulnerable points where they're just willing to do anything, they might not have the support of their family or friends, they know all of this. So the new actor is like a real prime candidate for Scientology. Now, of course, like I said, backstage newspaper. They buy the biggest, glossiest ads in backstage newspaper because where do actors go when they get off of that Greyhound bus and they go to the Samuel French bookstore, which is, you know, books where they sell different, like, acting books on, you know, the craft. They're going to pick up a copy of backstage newspaper. Scientology knows that. They have all the ads, and you're going to see one of their industry seminars. They may advertise about one of their books. Backstage actually throws a convention for actors called Actor Fest. And it's held in LA, New York, Chicago, just the different like major acting markets. And they have it in, you know, like usually late fall or the winter in LA. And, you know, thousands of actors come. And they have just different like actor related vendors and businesses, headshot photographers, casting directors have like workshops and different things there that you can sign up for. So it's a, you know, it's a big event in the year for actors to come and they network with different people, so on and so forth. So, um, you know, businesses normally just have like the standard booth, but Scientology has almost like the whole entire back wall of the place. And, um, you know, they just have all of their pretty smiling, you know, Sea Org workers, which are their staff members of the Celebrity Center. And, um, you know, they start talking about Scientology and talk about their workshops, talk about their classes. And they basically, you know, get people to sign up to come into the Celebrity Center for whatever they're, you know, selling at the time. And um, it's big for them because they don't have to convince people at first to come into the Celebrity Center. These actors are just walking around and they can approach them, bring them back to the booth and, you know, um, do the first introduction right then and there. So ActorFest is a very big um, recruitment for Scientology. And they have different, you know, acting related um, companies that are owned by Scientologists that are also there and you know those different acting schools that are run by Scientologists eventually start talking to you know you as a new actor in their class and they'll start saying stuff like wow you know um, you just have a little bit of stage fright you know you know I'm a Scientologist and you know there's this great place called the Celebrity Center and we can actually help you with that so you know whether you get into Scientology directly through you know the actual Scientologist, or you get in through one of their other um, acting-related Scientology front groups. I mean, you're bound to be introduced to Scientology one way or the other as an actor, as a musician, as someone trying to break into the entertainment industry. So that's why it's really important to see and know 
what this group is up to. So you don't even have the curiosity like I did to go in there and then end up giving them basically, you know, all your money and all your time and you just realize it's just a money-making organization. Another way that actors get roped in are through acting auditions. And there are two main sites that actors submit themselves on every day for acting work. And that's Actors Access and LA Casting. So about once or twice a month on each one of those sites, you're gonna see a posting for maybe a Scientology video. Come in and audition at the Celebrity Center and they'll have like a number of different roles for each project that cover just like a whole variety of different types of different people. So there's usually the direct way through the Scientology video, but sometimes they'll mask it a little bit and they'll say, um, come in to audition for the Way to Happiness PSA. Now the Way to Happiness is a Scientology book, but people may not know that and they'll submit for it and they're really going to be in a Scientology film. They'll go to the Celebrity Center to audition for the film and then afterwards, like I've seen like different staff members come up to different actors who are coming out of an acting audition and say, well, since you're here, I mean, if you're curious to find out what Scientology really is, let's let's watch this video display or here, read this pamphlet about what Scientology is. There's so many actors like yourself who are in Scientology right now, and, you know, we can help you with a number of problems. Here, look at these different courses we're offering. Boom, they put you in the Regis office, and they get you signed up for your first course. Milton Katselis was a famous acting teacher, and he taught an exclusive master class at the Beverly Hills Playhouse. And some of his students are like Alec Baldwin, George Clooney, Michelle Pfeiffer. So he taught a lot of really huge names in Hollywood. He was the go-to acting teacher. Now Milton was a longtime Scientologist since the 1960s. And he was an OT5 and he used his classes as a, like a recruitment ground for Scientology. So say you're an actor in class and maybe you're hitting like a roadblock or you know, you're not feeling like you can really access your emotions and you're just not really doing well. Well, Milton will use that opportunity to say, look, you know, I have this church that I go to and we have courses that can help unleash that creativity inside of you. So you're an actor and you're going to class and then you end up going into Scientology. You may not get in through Milton directly introducing it to you, but you're using these Scientology principles in your work. He's using Scientology philosophy and different ideas to help you in your acting work. So you're basically in a Scientology acting class. So this was like the main recruitment ground for many of the top actors that you see in Scientology. Milton introduced Scientology to them. Now Milton died a couple years ago and his classes are no longer running. So this isn't now a recruitment tool for Scientology in 2013, but this was like the main way they recruited actors back in the day.